Ladakh is entirely different, geographically as well as social and economic situations. Uh, Leh is in a very remote area of the Jammu and Kashmir state, covered by two borders, Pakistan border as well as Chinese border, very altitude. And it's very cold in winter, almost closed for six months, cut off from the rest of the state. Very distant places where we never had the convenience and facilities to for the transportation. Ladakh Heart Foundation is non-profit, non-political organization. It's NGO. So we provide the health care for community and uh, people of Ladakh. Ladakh Heart Foundation is started in 1997 when I was in Delhi. And during that time I've seen this a lot of uh, patients uh, came from Ladakh for treatment, especially heart disease. And then I realized uh, must be there is uh, there are a lot of people who are coming from Ladakh. It's far from Ladakh. And secondly, the, uh, the six months remain closed. They have to fly. They have no choice. People coming from the low-lying areas, they suffer from altitude problems like pulmonary edema as well as cerebral edema. So the rheumatic heart disease is preventable and then they asked me to do some work and then I bought the penicillin injection, then I spoke with the health department and then we donate the penicillin injection and distro water and all these things to prevent the acute rheumatic fever. And the good thing is we prevent the acute rheumatic fever. That is our, one of the achievements, one of the, our doctor effort and foundation effort and nurses and everybody, you know, because of the effort, now no more rheumatic heart disease. We change the uh, objective we do uh, according to the situation, according to the lifestyle, according to the economic and development and the, the lifestyle is changing, disease is also changing. According to that, we also uh, change our, uh, uh, do other things also. Totally concerned with the woman's health. Yes, preventive as well as the curative health. We can look after the patient's well-being during the Antenatal checkup during the checkup during from the beginning of the pregnancy to the uh, till the delivery. I screen them. Any any condition which is dangerous, any condition is resist. We always take care of them, starting from puberty to menopause. We can really help a lot. Doctors, volunteer nurses, or non -med medical people who are giving. Uh, suggestion, suggestion and helping me financially or you know paperwork and there's so many people involving in this foundation and mainly we have all the retired doctor, retired nurses they work as a volunteer some of them are very uh, small I mean it's very little salary uh, you know most of them are doctor, senior doctor, volunteer they won't charge anything and every month we have uh, almost 400 to 700 patients coming to these hospitals. And then we do also going out of the, you know, reach to village, doing medical camp. And then we meantime, we do prevention of uh, different kind of uh, disease. Prevention is the best thing. The treatment is second issue. How to, uh, you know, challenge with uh, different types of disease. What is the prevention? What is the people need more knowledgeable about their health issues? Try to uh, understand their psychology. We communicate, we take time to discuss patients, you know, and uh, discuss and their problems to solve. So try to satisfy them, then send them back. This is what a patient wants. It is not the medicine, it is not the operation, it is anything. But you want to make them understand what is the problem here. Patient is my everything. I am for the patients and patient expects too much. And we have to do as much as we can do in a right kind of thing.